This is the new soundtrack of suburbia. And it's being played all over America. For some, it's music to their ears. To others, a never-ending irritant. Pickleball is the fastest growing sport in the US. Fans say it's a cross between ping pong and tennis, but with less ground to cover and a slower pace, the boomers are enjoying it as much as the teenagers. The popularity of pickleball is ridiculous. Lynn helped start this club in Santa Monica less than two years ago. Now they can't keep up with the demand. People line up a half an hour before the courts open so they can get a space. I have two knee replacements, people play with hip replacements, but we also have young 13-year-old people play, people in wheelchairs play. It's a very social activity. Tennis, on the other hand, you have to make a plan with a partner. Pickleball's popularity has soared thanks to its celebrity fans. Andre Agassi, an eight-time tennis Grand Slam champion, has not only switched sports, he now co-owns a pickleball paddle company and competes in the biggest tournaments in the world. I'm a tennis player, so I am biased at, at, at heart. It's what I've done my whole life. The tennis is sort of the most nuanced uh, kind of racket demand sport, um, you know, that, that exists. But with that being said, when you trickle down into a, a sport like pickleball, it's, it's such a great equalizer, right? And it's on such a smaller dimension. So the community aspect is really fun and engaging. <laughs> How many things can you do at sort of, let's just say my age, right? I'm 53 now, where you actually get better at it. As fun as pickleball is, and I think it's a lot of fun, few issues have caused as many arguments at council meetings across America as this sport. OK, thank you. Across LA, tennis and pickleball diehards are going head to head at a town hall forum. I'm all for pickleball, but not at the expense of tennis. I don't think anybody that here as a pickleball player would want to take over your court. I'm just hoping that nothing changes on the tennis side. There's 100 people here talking about pickleball versus tennis. When I do a town hall, I can only get six to eight people to talk about theft and violent crime and auto things like that. Notice how I'm hitting my backhand. Tensions aside, most here agree that thanks to pickleball, more people are finding regular exercise accessible and enjoyable. And surely that can only be a good thing. Martha Kellner, Sky News, Los Angeles.